With Bob Popper, we wanted to explore what it meant to have two players sharing one space and one screen and see if we could encourage body contact. The aim of Bubble Popper is to pop as many bubbles as possible within 60 seconds. Players pop bubbles by hitting the wall with their augmented gloves. We don't want to confuse players, we kept Bubble Popper really simple. This enables us to kind of monitor the research, understand what players are doing and it really makes it easy for anyone to jump in and play. Bubble Popper is comprised of a Wiimote, a projector, a laptop, the augmented gloves and a surface to project the game onto. Through Bubble Popper, we wanted to explore what, what it meant for the player to be physically involved with the other player's space. Originally Bubble Popper, the bubbles were static. We changed it so that the bubbles were moving around. This encouraged people to also move around and kind of use the space up a lot more. Players aren't always ready to have that physical contact happening, maybe because they have this preconception that computer games aren't supposed to be physical. We are thinking that we may have to kind of plan this a bit differently, so we kind of introduce it more as a sport rather than kind of a screen-based thing. Uh, but when we, when we have someone who knows that it's physical play the game and people observe this, then they're more likely to have that extra step of physicality. Bubble Popper is definitely an exertion game and we want it, we see it more as a sport almost. We want it to kind of get to that level. So that's kind of where we're heading with it. It's the Exertion Lab. Have a good one. We hope you enjoyed popping bubbles.